Hello again, Robert Veach from V Paranormal One. Talk about a new device that I uh, developed for paranormal research. It's called the Para TV. There are a lot of old analog TVs out there because the government recently switched to digital about two years ago. So I had a lot of these TVs laying around, and I thought about the concept of a ghost box that scans the various frequencies in the FM band. So I thought about what if you scanned similar frequencies in the television band, the old analog bands. So I did a little research on the internet and found that uh, the FCC recently deallocated uh, several frequencies that really can't be used for anything. Turns out that's channels 52 through 69. Um, so I found an old TV, an old tube TV, and uh, saw that it was able to channel scan quite rapidly without blinking the screen to blue or um, uh, having a slow scan like a lot of analog TVs do in the new digital ones. And what I did is I took a the, took the remote from that TV, which is right here, and um, instead of holding down the channel down or channel up button, I wired in a micro switch. So you throw the micro switch and point it towards the TV and the TV then will go through a scanning process. So you program the TV to actually scan those frequencies, those 52 through 69. That's what I've done. Um, I'll show you in a second here how it works. Um, but I want to explain a little bit. The TV looks a little strange on the outside. There's actually a metalized uh, coating, a uh, tape that I put around the whole television, including the bottom and the back, as much of the front as I can. And that is electrically conductive tape uh, that's forming a ground loop all around the television. And then that is electrically wired to the plug to the earth ground. And the reason I did is because when I first tried the television, because it's an analog TV and it has a tube and there's a lot of high voltage there and a lot of electrostatic. So I, I did some measurements with my K2 and my millimeter and it was a little bit high. I didn't want to affect the environment. So by putting that shield on the television, I reduced about 75% of the EMF that comes off the television and electrostatic field. And so that ended up working really great. Um, so now we'll show you what the TV looks like. So here you can see the TV. I have the uh, remote pointing in front of the TV. I have the switch thrown on the remote so that's doing a down scan. And you can see it's going from those channels that I mentioned. It's going from the higher channels to the lower channels quite rapidly. And you can see that there's not really any image here because there's nothing going on activity-wise. Once in a while you see a little bright blip. And uh, so if we get any activity, then it'll be displayed. And I usually will be running the ghost box in the session along with the uh, Para TV. And it looks kind of strange. You can't maybe see it here, but there is this aluminized coating that's painted black. And that's all the way around the television, as you can see right here. And there's a... Uh, one and a half foot antenna that I made for the back of the television. And this material is conductive, it's painted black, and it's actually wired to earth ground on the plug. And like I mentioned, that reduced the EMF and electrostatic charge of the TV about 75% reduction. So that allowed it to be used uh, during a paranormal investigation. So by using the Para TV, along with all the other devices I developed, just one more tool to help verify the paranormal. Thanks for watching.